Mina-san, konnichiwa. This is David. And Mina. And this afternoon, uh, we're reviewing the Kuranai Musha oh Red my Warrior. God, she is so cute. Yes, she is very adorable. Um, so this is a mostly finished model. Um, I did not put the stickers on it. The reason is, is the stickers are um, very much SD stickers. They kind of look a little bit cheap. Um, and this is a super detailed kit. This really, really, really asks for paint. Like, look here. You are getting a little bit of focus here. Tons of awesome panel lines along those skirts, along that chest piece and the feet. Um, you've got these really cool shoulder pieces, everything like that. And... Um, it's just, it's it's a really cool looking kit, and I think it really deserves paint. It really deserves real personal attention. It's a crime if you don't panel line that. Yeah, yeah. So, I'm going to give it some paint, um, and I, but I will talk a little bit about these stickers and things like that. So first off, um, this is it. This is it. The whole kit, um, it doesn't have any break-off accessory pieces, um, anything like that, um, that can't just be on the body. She has a cannon on her shoulder. This cannon is um, attached very, very well, actually. She has two shields. And she has a katana. Now, for those of you who are interested in what these stickers look like, because I know some people do that sort of thing, and I occasionally do, which is not on this kit. We have... Oh, also, she has kunai on her um, on her head. She has two kunai. Uh, they make up her sort of V-fin. Uh, we have silver shiny pieces for the katana uh, that will basically cover your katana entirety. Uh, and you have two silver pieces for the kunai. Um, I did use the eye stickers, actually, uh, because that's actually hard to paint, and you can't really get a better effect than that. Um, she has four eyes and two of them, you can actually put two of them on the kit and reverse them, just like a lot of SDs these days. Um, you've got the kawaii eyes, you've got the shifty left, shifty right eyes. Um, and then you've got, so for the stickers, you've got these turrety looking pieces for the sides, for the, the shoulders. You have um, a couple pieces for the skirts. You have a couple pieces for the chest. Um, these are like the flaps of the skirt. So they're not bad stickers as far as SDs go, but I really want this to punch. I really want this to stand out. Um, now the other thing that it does is it has a slight transformation gimmick. Um, I haven't done it yet, so I'm gonna kind of learn with you guys right now. So you're supposed to take off the kunai and you're supposed to take off the cannon um, and then you take off her helmet. She has two parts of a helmet. She has a, this part and she has her normal helmet. So I'm going to take off this part. You take off her hair. And you take off her backpack. And her shields. This is a pretty complicated um, transformation gimmick, actually. And then you take off her shoulder pieces. Oh, and this thing reverses, so you can have like a single shot cannon, or you can have like a Gatling cannon. It's kind of cute. Um, so this goes on to the... Uh, I don't know how that goes on. Oh, right there. There's a little clipping piece that goes on here to connect the backpack with that. And then you have the shoulder pieces which connect onto this little thing. And then you have the two shields, which become wheels. Oh, I put those in the wrong hole. Okay. And then you take the helmet piece and I believe you, let's see, you slide it on here. Oh, there you go. And now you have a little chariot with a Gatling gun on it. Um, like you do. And she, of course, can stand behind this and, you know, man, the, 
chariot Gatling cannon thing. Um, oh my god. Isn't it cute? <clears throat> I'm just mad I don't have one. We'll have to get you one, because they're cheap. They're... No, I, I meant a Gatling cannon. Oh, for realsies. Yeah. yeah. It would deal with a lot of arguments on the internet very quickly. Um, although, I guess I would put her hair back on, and her kunai back on. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know why you had to take them off other than to get the helmet off, I guess. Well, and you don't want to leave that stuff lying around and lose it. Right. Or to fall on the wrong hands, whatever. <laughs> you fall on the wrong hands. Yeah. Uh, also, I think her kunai will... Uh, no, they don't go on the arms. I thought they went on the arms. She has these weird, like, hook things on her arms. Um, but they don't really do anything special, I don't think. Although, let me check the instructions. They might... No, they don't appear to. So anyway, there is our Kunai Musha Red Warrior. Amazing. Her articulation is SD articulation. Um, if you are expecting a lot of articulation, don't buy SD kits, basically. Um, they, 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 they don't have necks. They, they, don't, they only have single-jointed arms. They have um, single-jointed legs that are more like feet with a little post on them. Um, these, are, these are not particularly articulate kits. That's kind of the point. They're supposed to be adorable and awesome. And she um, excels in both of those categories. So, um, she is moderately poseable. Uh, like, you can, of course, pull out her katana and make her all badass and stuff like that. Um, but, you know, these are not hardcore, you know, action pose toys. So, anyway, I love it. I think I paid, like, eight dollars ish for it uh i don't know the msrp offhand but i i think it's a really great little sd kit i've been really looking forward to it i really love the lady my um Kai kawaguchi uh i love her role in build fighters um uh, try so much and i um yeah we're, we're gonna have to get another one of these i, I think, think. So. yeah um so i might i might post pictures once i've painted it because i think it really deserves some um extra gold and stuff like that um and we'll see about that anyway uh if you have any uh, recommendations any requests like that just you know hit us up um if you haven't like us subscribe us all of that shit, and matane <laughs>